Hey everyone, it's your host, Panfish Guy, and welcome back to the channel. We're doing some fun fishing today at Pickwick Dam near Counts, Tennessee. So hey everybody, it's the Panfish Guy and we are down at Pickwick Lake and <clears throat> uh, we're going to get up to some crappie fishing tomorrow, but for right now we're going to go check out the spillway and Captain Carl is going to show us how to get on some catfish bait. We're going to catch, we're going to catch us some, what do they call them things? What do they call these things we're fishing for again, Carl? Skipjacks. Skipjacks. All right. Back. Gotcha. So maybe two or three you may get, you know. <laughs> All right. Now, is it my understanding these are slimy boogers, aren't they? I brought my I brought my brush pile jigs one. A couple of them. All right, come here. Sir, you hey, look with, at that. Are you with Mr. Uh, what's the, what do you suppose is a good amount of skipjack? As many as you can get. We gonna do this again tomorrow night too? Yeah, we ain't got nothing to do. I'm gonna come back tomorrow. Yeah. Teamed up with my buddy Captain Carl, three day John, to a good place. The next two days of crappie fishing, Carl wanted to stock up on some fresh Tennessee carp. Also, we were skipping. We were catfish. They like the spoon, Carl. Baby tarpon. In the bucket. He made it. We made a new friend Bill at the spillway, the gentleman in the blue shirt, and he enlightened me on the name Tennessee Tarpon. And after catching a few, I understand why they call them that. Those things are jumpy, and it's a really pretty fish to boot. We had a blast fishing for them, 
and with others' help, we were able to fill up a couple buckets full in pretty short order. We met some really nice people there, and Bill and others who weren't fishing for Skipjack were happy to help fill up the buckets when they caught one. It was a really fun day, even though my, even though my back was killing me, and it wasn't fishing for panfish. The fellow fishing down from us was fishing for striper and he hooked into something huge. I ended up getting an assist when he finally wore it down and it was a big old spoon bill. It was pretty cool. I had hooked something earlier that put up a similar fight. Heck, it might have been the same fish. Until next time. Thing here? Down here? There you go. I'll grab that one. That's a hell of a fish there. Get you some slack. There you go. Now, are those things in season? Uh, you know, I don't know. <laughs> That's a heck of a fish right there. Want to get a picture of them? Uh, and, uh, I got a camera here in my pocket. All right. So that's going to do it for this episode, but make sure you check out the all-new My724Outdoors.com page. Hit up the forums and post your adventures. It's great stuff. Also, check out my socials at PanfishGuy on Facebook, Daniel Palmer 5623 on Instagram, at PanfishG on Twitter, or my webpage at PanfishGuy.com. Log on and grab some swag for your favorite fishermen. If you like this video, please like, share it with your friends, and subscribe to the channel. Rub a little fish slime on that notification bell so you'll be notified when I infrequently post a video. Hey, knock it off!